Hello everyone, welcome back to The Hunter. Once again, we're checking out the Mississippi Acres Preserve and it's one of my favorites so far. We're doing some alligator hunting today. We've got Benny right here laying down. He's a good boy uh, and we're gonna get started. So I've already hunted this area last night. We're gonna move over this way and we're gonna actually hunt this lake. I think that's gonna be a good spot here. We have a neat zone for the American alligator that just scared the hell out of me. Wind's not doing us any favors, so I'm gonna go ahead and just spray myself here to kind of get rid of my scent as we come closer to this lake over here. Now, alligators, they can sense vibration really well, so as we get closer to this lake, I'm gonna start slowing down and getting a lot lower. Weapon of choice today is gonna be the seven millimeter. I, you can use a 303, I believe, and the seven millimeter. I was using a 338 on the alligators. It's a little OP to do that, so we're gonna try to be a little more realistic when it comes to the weapon class versus the animal. Um, so that's what we're rolling with so far. Hey, Benny, let's give you some love, buddy. Yeah, let's give you some love. There we go. I have my ghillie suit on as well. I did create that Apex account that was needed for that. Let's give him a little bit of a pet. I've already given him all of my dog treats that I had on me, so we want to make sure that he's in, you know, a good mood as we are as well. And a very happy Tuesday to all of you. I hope you guys are having a great week so far and uh, you're ready to see some alligator hunting, cause we down here in Mississippi, we gonna make it happen. So we have some deer around here that are chattering and making all sorts of noise, but we're here for the alligator. And uh, let me tell you, you can get alligator all times of the day. They're active during dusk and dawn, but you can get them at any time of the day. And that's exactly what we're gonna do here. So we have made it to the lake and there's a rest zone right there. We're gonna start slowing everything down. Oh, there's a deer right there, check that out. That's a doe. And I know there's a buck around here too. We're not gonna scare them just yet. We wanna get alligators. Only pet peeve with this preserve is, man, it does rain a lot here and it's kind of annoying. I wish we had an option to either have rain on or off. You know, if you wanna hunt in the rain, it's one thing, but I'm not a big fan. All right, we got a alligator hissing already. He, he can feel our presence. Now we can set up a tripod, which we're probably gonna do, but let's see if I can see this alligator that's hissing at us here. I don't. Know where he's at. He's probably in the water, I would imagine. So we're gonna get a little closer and probably set up a tripod right down there. I'm gonna have my dog lay down right here. Just stay here at home base, buddy. You don't need to go anywhere else right now. Okay, we gave this a little bit of a uh, try here for a while now and no such luck. So we're just gonna go ahead and take this down and we're gonna take a different approach to this. Let's go find some alligator, buddy. Let's go find some alligator. We're gonna go around uh, this way. Something is really close to me. Sounds like a deer to me. Get my 270 out. We're gonna shoot something if, if we can. It's just right here. Oh, there it, oh, I think it's a fox or something. Oh, it's an alligator. It's a big boy. Where are you going, buddy? Where are you going, huh? Smoked it, got it. Yes! Ew, I was like, is that a deer? What is that? We're gonna shoot something. We got ourselves a gator. Damn, man. We, and I'm telling you what, this 333, I think there's something going on with the, um, the class being off on the weapons versus the alligators. But it could just be me being really terrible. That as well, yeah, we shot him right there. But we had to get ourselves a gator, didn't we? And here we go. We got a pretty good spine shot on him. I was going for the lungs there, which we did get the lung as well. Uh, but I was shooting for that that area right there to just drop it. It was a female, 223 pounds. Nothing too crazy. But we'll definitely take that one. There's that seven, a very hard, 240 yards out. Let's go ahead and try to arrange our weapon in here. I think we might be able to get a shot on this thing. Um, we could probably set it to 328. I mean, it's right there. We might be, it's pretty far out though still. Let's see, let's kind of just wait here and see what it does. About 175, he's coming right for us here. He's coming right for us. <laughs> here we go. Pop him right there. Man, the recoil on these things. I don't even know if we even hit, I can't even see where it went. I set our sights to 164. It's pretty close. This is gonna be a good shot, right? There. I think we hit it. We got it. Hell yeah. You are done, buddy. Woohoo. 
And this is after an hour and 12 minutes of hunting these things, man. You got to be patient with them. Okay, this is going to be a big one right here. Look at this guy. All right. Finally, we get something good. Whoa. There's another one over there. Okay. It knows I killed uh, its friend. <laughs> so that earlier shot did land. We got him right there in the face. And then he went down, and then we saw him again, and boom. That's when we took him out completely. 961-pound male. What? That's a big gator right there, buddy. That is a big <laughs> gator. That's the one that was hissing us 403 yards out. We're not going to make that shot. I'm going to continue back around that way, backtrack our way. We might be able to get another one. Okay, made it back to camp. We're going to go to sleep. And we're going to get up at around 11 p.m. is what we're going to aim for. So 2300. It's going to be nighttime, and we're going to switch everything over to our night vision setup. Another thing they've got to do away with is this storage and your inventory setup. It's just less than ideal, to be perfectly honest with you. All right, we've made it to the swamp, and it has started raining again. Oh, joy. But we'll see. We can find some gators out here. They're going to be real active around this time. Looks like we have a rest zone up here. Already got one doing a mating call out there in the distance. And there he is right there, 295 yards. So, yep, looks like we're going to have some gators. I'm going to start moving up ever so slightly. Got to go real slow here and be patient. I'm going to get a little bit closer before I take a shot on this guy because he seems like he's coming right for us. Yeah, he is 139 yards right there. All right. That's what we want to see. All right, what do we get here? Let's take the shot. Right there. Went for a lung shot, actually. Try to drop him in one hit. I think we definitely hit him. Yeah, we got him. Look at that. I I wanted to go with the lung shot on that one. That was that was good. It's starting to light on and go recover the body. Wow, man. We we nailed him there. Like you want to get that brain shot, but it's so difficult sometimes. It's just better to take that lung shot. Because you know you're going to take him out. We have another one out there. He's not very happy. Okay, so what we got? Flesh, right scapula, right lung. Yep, that's what I went with. The lung shot like I was talking about. That's exactly what I wanted. Nicely done. Killed him pretty fast. Only 131 yard uh, shot there. And only a you know weapon score of 15-3-3. But we'll take it. 910 pounds, by the way. Another male over here making a bunch of noise. But yeah, like I said, they're hissing in the water. I'm not a huge fan of that. Uh, I think they should only be able to hiss if they're like surfaced, but yeah, whatever. And he's surfaced. He's a level six. He's kind of trying to get away from us here. It looks like, oh, and that's what I'm talking. There's that insta drop. And he was pretty far on the edge there. Yeah. Not sure what that one's about. I'm moving my way back uh, to the northeast here and I'm watching this one right over here. I don't think that's the same one we had earlier. Maybe that it's him. I think he just swam to the other side of the pond when he dived. I'm pretty sure that's what he did. Okay. And he did it again. Yeah, he's being really elusive. That's because we're in it. I've got some purple splotches here now. So there he is. Yeah, he swam back all the way over there. He's 300 or sorry, 138 yards out. He's swimming right towards us. All right, dude, I'm going to pop 132. Let's see what we got here. We're at 164. It should be pretty good lined up on that. Let's go for a headshot on this guy right behind his ear in. I don't think it hit him because they make them. They make a big, huge splash if you do. And yeah, they're not lying. Level six hard. Yeah, you're not kidding. Kind of just sitting in the water there, isn't it? Yeah, I think it's 130, 140 out. Hard to say. We got another one over here. I think they're just I think there's a bunch of level sixes in this particular swamp. So we're going to start moving down this way. I'm tired of playing these alligator games over there. Sorry, bud. I'm going after a different one, and he's over here somewhere. Oh, there's one real close by. Where are you at, bud? I did not. He's on land over here. Okay. That's good. Just stay on land, bud. It's close. It's real. I hear it. Oh, my God. It's right here. I see it. I see it. Think I got a hit on it. It's going in the water. No, you don't. Woo, that was scary. That was a little scary right there with the sound of that. We got him. Yes. We nailed you, bud. 
We nailed you. Come on in. Oh, Whew, I can see those red glowing eyes right around that corner right away. He was hiding in that bush. He was not in the water. Is this, are you the one we were shooting at over there earlier? I hope so. I sure hope so. Cause I'm done with you, bud. We are done with you. This is not the same one, but it was a level four easy male, 636 pounds. Yep, we got the lung shot. Look at that, right through both. Flesh, right lung, left lung, 100%. It was only 21 yards away. Yeah, that guy was, uh, he, he was uh, running for the water big time, but we took him down. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this episode of the Hunter Call of the Wild. Let me know what you thought of the... Uh, preserve what you thought of the alligator hunting. I sure enjoyed it. Uh, we're at about an hour and 52 minutes uh, of hunting. So it's you have to be patient with the alligators, but I love the challenge they bring. It's hard to hit those shots sometimes, especially with a seven mil. Um, I think a lot of you guys that play the hunter a lot and you're really good at uh, finding the ranges of that um, have been able to take them down with the, the 303 and with the seven millimeter. But for me, the the range master just works. It kills them usually in one shot or two, um, as we saw here tonight. And uh, I had a lot of fun doing it. That is for certain. It's been fantastic stuff. But that'll do it. See you next time. Take care.